Hey guys, KT here. Welcome back to some more Days Gone, where we are currently following Schizo as we are stuck in a mine trying to find some dynamite. So let's go ahead and see uh, what Schizo has. Uh, the Which way Schizo wants us to go. Schizo, hold, hold on, hold on. This doesn't seem right. What? What are you talking about? This isn't the way that we came in. What? what? You think these flares got up and moved themselves? Yeah, maybe I got turned around. Wait, no. Cause now, Torres. Wait a minute, god damn it. Th this is the main tunnel. What? It's the it's the main tunnel. You see the tracks? We weren't following any tracks on our way in. What the hell? But, but these are my flares, damn it. How did the Wait. Oh, someone's fucking with us. Come on, this way. Hold up, hold up, wait a second. Freaks could be moving them. Zay. Maybe a new mutation? Who the hell's in here? Come on out! Show yourself! Excuse me, put that thing away. What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is one shot. One. It's all it takes to bring all the freaks in these tunnels down on top of us. Well, I thought you said these tunnels would be clear this time. No. <laughs> what the hell? Look out! I can't get a shot! Oh, God damn it! God damn it, it's got the keys. Shit. Where are you going? It's got the keys, we gotta catch it. Wait, come back. God damn it, Skizzo, it's getting away. Okay, here we go. Let's look for the new. Damn it, shit, get back here. Come on, you shit, give me back those fucking keys. God. Oh shit, there you are! Come on, kill it! And let's grab our key. Wait, okay. So he was fucking with us. I would say the newts are yeah, a little smarter, so. Oh, that fucker. Stop shooting. Oh shit. Guess I'm bring the whole mind down on us. Damn it. Okay, okay. About time he started listening. At least I can, uh, shoot. I got silencers, but nah, Schizo's like, nah, we ain't doing that. What the, what the hell are you talking about? Alright, uh, let's go ahead. Fucking hell, Schizo. Go! I hate this melee weapon already. There we go. Looks like the last of them. So much for the tunnels being clear. I told you what would happen if you fired your weapon. What was I supposed to do? Throw rocks at him? Supposed to do is useless. Fucking listen to me. Next time, try this. Whatever. You're welcome. For what? For saving your ass. If you hadn't run off, my ass wouldn't need saving. <laughs> Are you ready to fucking finish this? Yeah, I'm ready. 
This way. Schizo's just being a whitey little bitch. So, he grows off. Addy said it looked like someone tried to burn his tax on. It was rippers, wasn't it? You got a point, Schizo? Had a drifter coming. Word's gone out. Rippers are looking for two men. Mongols? Sound like anyone you know? Well, as you can see, I'm still wearing the cut. We're not hiding, Schizo. Carlos wants Boozer. He won't have any trouble finding him. But he's gonna have to go through me first. There we go. Don't know if this is going to be more useful than other uh, melee items, but I'm hoping this one's at least decent. If not, I'll probably have to use the saw bat next time. I don't know. I don't know uh, the difference. They didn't really show, like, the changes, so. What'd you do to him? Gotta be something long before breaking the treaty. Long before I... You know what? I don't know and I don't care. Have I killed a few rippers in my day? You're goddamn right I have. And after what they did to Boozer, I'm gonna go right on killing the crazy sons of bitches. Yeah? And Carlos is crazier than any of them. You don't want to be on his shit list, bro. What'd I just say? I don't care. And I'm not your bro. Remember what I told Iron Mike? Carlos can go fuck himself. Hey, just looking out for you. You're one of us now, right? Yeah, yeah right. Don't worry about me and Boozer. We can look out for ourselves. Alright, let's see what uh, we're dealing with here. I love how cougars are being mentioned, but I haven't seen a single cougar the entire time I've been playing so far. This ought to make the old man happy. Shit's heavy. I thought I saw two, a couple cases. We were just taking one? Or are we going to come back later for the rest? Or is this just the game's way of saying we have it all, but we're not really going to be dealing with a lot of it? I don't know. We'll see. What are you talking about? You know the old man. Same as me. I got this. Got it. Thanks. He thinks that his treaty with the Rippers is going to keep us safe. The thing is, they don't give a shit about any treaty. The only reason they haven't come down here in force is because they're too busy up north, hitting Copeland, the hot springs. Yeah, I know I was there. So you know what I'm talking about. The Rippers are coming. And Iron Mike... He's just gonna let it happen. He's gonna let those bald-headed freak alikes wash over us like a goddamn red tie. Excuse me, so you don't know that. See the light of day. Shit, there's something else we agree on. That's twice in one day. Hold up for a second. There's someone out there. Hey, fight. Someone's inside. Hey, what you hiding out there? Shit in your pants. Come on, man. Come on. Mister, my boy's got a little rambunctious, I admit it. All right, uh, split up. Here, we'll know? surround him. You come on out got it. Talk to me. Watch your I'll back. That's all I gotta say. I love the fact that they were like, you can join us, we're all friendly here. When in all reality, they were gonna try to kill me the entire time. I think that's all the bastards. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, we gotta get that box of dynamite. 
Must have been All right. the same assholes who parted out the bikes. Ride by and they see ours. They figured they'd make an easy score. I guess it wasn't as easy as they'd hoped. You know, I hate to say it, but we actually make a good team, you and I. Well, then don't say it. Hey, there's something I gotta say. When you and Boozer rode into camp and Iron Mike welcomed you back again with goddamn open arms, I thought it was another sign the old man was losing it. Going soft. Okay, well, what's your point, Scott? <clears throat> My point is that you and me, we see eye to eye. I get that now. You know, same as me. If Iron Mike don't wake the hell up, the camp's not gonna last another six months. Okay, still waiting for your point. Look, I know I've been busting your balls. We both know that. But... A lot of people know what you've done. For your friend. How you've been doing shit for the camp. Changes are coming, brother. When Iron Mike retires, let's call it. I say you and me, we step up and run the camp together. You and me? Run the camp? <laughs> That's really what you wanted to talk hey, to me about. Hey, hear me out, goddammit. <laughs> Just listen to me a minute. Uh -huh. Look, I got a lot of friends on the camp council, and they agree. Most of them say the old man's gotta go. Yeah, that's bullshit, because Ricky would never go for well, She's as soft as the old Mike man, as you... trusts you. Well, that's his mistake. One of many. Oh, it ain't gonna be mine. Look, we all do things to survive, Schizo. I get that. You remember how I said there's some lines I ain't crossed? Stabbing a friend in the back, that's one of them. Better one old man in the entire camp. You think about that. we know uh that I am correct on one thing schizo really is gonna try and uh yeah, betray schizo, Iron Mike think about that. Jesus why would Iron Mike ever trust that house that alone make it more security fuck I was trying to be cool didn't really work out in my favor Motherfucker. Oh, uh, you know, if these were, if they were runners, it'd make more sense. But since these are regular wolves, the fact that they're eating bullets like nothing is actually Jesus, quite terrifying. That asshole, let alone make him head of security. I feel like uh, Skitzo's gonna try to get us killed. Especially if uh, he thinks we're not gonna go with him. Lost I already camp. feel Come that. In. Deacon St. John to Iron Mike. Deke, you and Schizo, you find them? The explosives? Yeah, Mike, uh, we got them. Schizo's on his way back with everything that we found. Listen, Mike, I gotta tell you. That's great. That's great. Now, we can't use them till we find some dead cord. You know that, right? I'll take a look through the files we got. Mike, listen to me. Schizo, he's on. Jesus, what now? You boys try and shoot your damn heads off again? No, Mike, but he, uh... He must have run the camp, Mike. He told me him... him... Oh, hell, I know all about that. Remember, I told you already. Schizo thinks I'm a pacifist. I'm gonna get us all killed. I know he's been talking. Mike! Deke, like I said, Schizo's got his issues, but... It... <sighs> it's not like we don't got ours. Thanks for your concern, but I can take care of myself. Mike, out. Uh, Jesus, all right. Have it your way, Iron Mike. You always do. The fuck? What are you doing out here? Hello? This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. 
Today, I want to talk about drugs. Now, I don't much care for them. They keep you numb, unreliable, and silent. In 1996, the CIA was accused of dealing cocaine in Central America. Used it to help them control the masses. Get the fed sticky fingers on a... Oh, okay, it was still loading in. I was like, the fuck? Is that it? I got this. Hang on. I, I love how I, uh, the game glitch. I, I love it. Where it's safe. Yeah. Where? Where? Show me. I'll go. Uh, yeah, go to Iron Mike's. Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. I, 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 was, I was done for. Holy shit! No. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh man. Yeah, let him know it was Deacon St. John. Don't stop. Just keep out of sight. Still uh weird the way that all played out. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Still can't believe that happened. Okay, there we go. And let's go ahead and get into the Someone camp. The Might as well. I love how I, I just looked and I just continued. Where's Boozer? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I thought he was with you. Yeah, he was, and then he, he took off. Some shit. Excuse me, what the fuck are you telling me? Get off me. Look, he grabbed a bottle of whiskey. He said he was going home. I don't know. Motherfucker, and you didn't even try to stop him, did you? Hey, we tried. <laughs> you gotta know when to cut a man loose. You gotta know when a man's done. It would be Schizo of all people who pretty much said fuck him. I, like, honestly, like, I figured it'd just be, uh, nobody knew where he went. If I heard him say something. Alright, well guys, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna end it here. If you enjoy, make sure to like, subscribe, check out the links in the description below. It really helps out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!